Caltech is credited for building Pasadena's largest solar power facility and operating a thriving campus recycling center. But its most original green venture is the university's annual Olive Harvest Festival. CBS 2's Dave Malkoff is live in Pasadena with a look at it in tonight's 615 Spotlight. Dave. You know, Paul, a lot of people around Southern California have olive trees in their neighborhood, but you can't eat the olives right off the branch. Leave it to the engineers here at Caltech to find out a way to take those decorative olives and bring them to the dinner table. Under the fall Pasadena sun, a centuries-old tradition is being handed down. Some of the smartest minds on earth have just discovered... Brad, I'm dropping now. The olives that have been right over their heads for generations. A few undergrads decided that it'd be a waste to have all the olives just basically being splashed onto the floor and being stepped on. The trees that litter the Caltech campus with messy olives have always been considered a nuisance. That was until those two undergrads decided to engineer themselves out of doing their assigned homework. It's an obvious solution, really. A year later, their efforts have bubbled into a huge olive festival feeding 2,000 people. A quest for laziness created all this work. I wouldn't call it work. It's enjoyable. Well, it's some work. Yeah. I had to fly down from San Francisco this morning to come yeah. help you out. There's effort in it, <laughs> yes. I'm a postdoc. Shin Lo spends her days so, trying to cure HIV. This is a welcome change. Although you will cure a lot of people in the world, but it's not the same as uh, something simple as this. You know what I mean? Not only that, students from all over the world are breaking bread tonight. We pick a good branch over here, right? And literally <laughs> extending an olive branch to each other. I'm Palestinian and he's Israeli and like we work together in the same lab. All thanks to this ancient fruit with a little bit of magic locked inside. You know, that stuff right there isn't actually olive oil. When you squeeze an olive, you get something like dirty water and olive oil out of the olive. To get the actual olive oil, you have to put it in a huge centrifuge to spin out the oil from the water. And of course, this is Caltech, and of course they have a huge centrifuge over there in the microbiology lab. We're live here at Caltech in Pasadena. I'm Dave Malkoff, CBS 2 News. You know, Dave, let me ask you a question, because I've been over to Caltech several times. I, I'm always intimidated over there, because I just feel like uh, whenever they look at you, it's like, uh, who's the idiot? Yeah, it's me. <laughs> oh, apparently Dave can't hear me. Here's another thing I've always wanted to do. Here's Johnny. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Yeah, you know what? Have a good weekend. Tell you us know, all about it. You're getting ignored by a lot of, by a lot of people. A lot of smart you people. You know what? It's just like being at home. <laughs> it is like being yeah, at home. It's like being at you home. You know, this is what's happening to go across the door of the sector of the country. By the way, your former home. Way up there in Minnesota, let me tell you, they've got a blizzard-like addition up there, up to a foot of snow coming down and 50-mile-per-hour winds. Storm to the north of us, we're located right there. We 